Hey guys, Operation RV back here again with another important video and I would like to discuss, uh, this is going to be a new DIY or a how-to video. Uh, first and foremost, yes, we are in my bathroom in my RV and you probably realize uh, at the beginning of the year, probably the first quarter, I did state that uh, I was going to do an upcoming video of my tub had a crack in it and I went ahead and patched it. Here it is. Uh, it is uh, still holding up guys but uh, what we have here is uh, I have another one right there go ahead and get in that so you can see roughly six inches so what I did is I went ahead and took off the access panel the shower currently to show you that this is dry there's no uh, there's no water or anything currently like that underneath there um, but again, this is what I'm using. Same old good stuff. I went ahead and picked up another roll on Amazon. This one's 25 feet long by four inches wide. It's the Quick Roof Extreme. Picked it up for like 30 bucks. Uh, what I love about it is it's pretty versatile. You can use it on anything and you can actually even use it in uh, why things are wet. Uh, it's made with a steel lock adhesive. Um, go ahead and check out my other prior video. But what, what I want to go ahead and uh, do a video over is how to fix a crack in your RV bathtub. So these things are pra uh, plastic, as you already know. I mean, they're pretty flimsy. They do the job. It's great. Can't complain. What I wanted to do is go ahead and show you a couple demonstrations. This is my scale. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how much weight is actually in the shower battery reads correctly and it's unfortunately it's not working but anyways uh, six feet about 320 pounds and uh, I want to go ahead and demonstrate how great this is by simply removing this off I'm gonna go ahead and I already pre-cut it about six inches I'm gonna take off this backing right here on the back and it's just as simple to apply just by peeling off this backing. This is going to be a one handed job. But what I was trying to show you about that scale is to show you that, that you know, that is my true weight. And what I want to demonstrate today is just how great this is because I plan on filling up the tub here momentarily and showing you uh, that it will actually hold instantly. That's how great this stuff is. And this stuff is sticky, as I explained in my prior video. So once it's on, it is on. Unfortunately, this crack that you do see right here, um, it's, it's in one of those crevices, part of the shower. So I think with a lot of the wear and tear, getting in and out of this tub, turning around, whatever, causes an additional crack. But I'm gonna go ahead and place this on. I'm gonna overlap my prior patch right here and also make sure um, I get the middle portion of that in the tub and all you got to do at this point just firmly put some uh, pressure go ahead and apply this down just like that like seriously this is already on and it's not coming off and a quick update too on my awning still have no issues I've been all over the US I've left it open again and still no issues but what I want to do go ahead and turn on this water see if I can get up to this line and I'll stand in the tub for a few minutes and I will get out and I'll go ahead and demonstrate that there is no water underneath this so let me get some uh, water in the tub there. As you see, it's already kind of filled up. Uh, I want to be conservative with the water so I won't fill it up too much. I'm going to go ahead and get in it and turn around just like so, guys. I'm standing on this crack right now. Here's my hand, all my pressure on that crack. Okay. Go 
ahead and pull this drain out. And let's see what happens underneath. We'll go ahead and get out. Let's see if this did justice, guys. Wow, look at that. So right here, I'm gonna use my screwdriver as a pointer. Right here. That is where that crack was. No water on the support plate. And of course, uh, let me see if I can zoom in. No water anywhere, guys. Dry sawdust, that's all you get. Seriously. Let me zoom back in. That's it, right here. Come back over the top again. That's the patch. I know it's ugly, but honestly, guys, it does a job and it's not gonna cost you three hundred dollars for a new shower tub it's versatile you can use it on all kinds of stuff um, let's see very minimal surface uh, surface preparation um, it's guaranteed not to crack harden shrink uh, instantly stops leaks and permanently repairs all RV roof materials, vents, skylights, slide outs, windows, awnings, holding tanks, tents, and more. Um, and again, this is another more product that it actually fixes. Um, anyways, guys, I wanted to demonstrate another DIY video on how to keep your RV maintained. And if you do fall into a, a situation like myself, where you do have a crack it's not over you don't have to spend 300 and plus dollars on a, on a new shower tub go ahead and click on uh, Google get into Amazon go ahead and uh, type this in uh, quick roof extreme and uh, you will not you will not be uh, unhappy with this product anyways thanks for tuning in guys uh, love the support love the comments love the thumbs up as always, thanks for checking in and see you next time. Peace.